Hello everyone. Today I'm going to share with you uh, the scripting inside uh, visual scripting inside Spark AR. So yeah, today's uh, goal is to tap the screen and then the genie will come out from the lamp. So okay, so this is the final result. Yeah, uh, of the um, of today's um, uh, showcase. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so um, because there are a lot of stuff to cover, so I am going to share with you how I achieve the whole uh, visual scripting, and then I will uh, walk through walk you through the whole process and later on I will upload the whole project to the cloud so if you are interested in learning more you can pretty much download the entire project uh, inside uh, 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 to, from the cloud okay so let's start first uh, I just create maybe I can uh, share with you another file okay so that's having another file okay i will uh, start it over okay so let's create a plane tracker insert and then let's add the um a no object uh this no object uh will be uh under the uh, plane tracker this will be the uh, you know the registration point for the um for the tip on top of just the you know the lamp like where uh, this is kind of the entrance where the um, the genie come out so let's add uh, assets okay so let's add the lamp first texture source okay so let's add the lamp okay so let's add the texture. Oh shit. Um, let's add the texture of this. Okay, so let's add the texture. Mm, the texture. Okay, so this is the texture. Okay, so let's put the lamp under this. Okay, so this is the lamp. And then let's rotate it. And then scale it down. Okay, cool. This is kind of like a. Yeah, later on, uh, we need to adjust a lot just to make like an illusion that the uh, genies comes out from from the uh, you know the, the the this part of the lamp. Okay, the opening of the lamp. Okay, then let's add uh, the genie. Okay, cool. Genie, ain't genie. Oh. Okay. Okay, so at this one. Okay, where's the genie? Oh, wow. Okay, so that's put under it. Okay, so this is a genie. And I think it's kind of like not the. Yeah, so this is a genie. Right? Okay, so we are going to kind of like uh, shrink it down and make sure it's kind of like a from here. Okay. Okay, so this is something that we want, right? Okay, so let's do some fun stuff. Okay, so we want this entire scene when we tap. When we tap the screen, um, like the genie was invisible and uh, uh, make it super small, like the scale is zero, zero, zero. So it's almost nothing. And then it's from this tip and then grow to be a giant genie. Okay, so that's the go. Okay, so what we need to do is to select the whole thing and then create. The whole, yeah, create, hit interaction and hit create. Okay, so this is the start of the crazy journey. Okay, 
I watch a lot of tutorials and I, I look up um, Spark AR uh, Learning Center. So I pretty much uh, from other tutorials and uh, the descriptions of Spark AR page, official website page, I kind of figure out the whole thing. So some of them, I, I have to see the cheat sheet. Yeah, so if you don't mind. But I will explain the whole um, thinking process and you can adjust everything according to your needs. That's for sure. Okay, so this is the plan, right? This, so we are going to attach this patch to this, the, the whole, um, the whole 3D object. Okay, so this, so when we select it, pretty much we can take this out. Okay, so we take this out and then we need, what we need is to tap, right? So we need to, uh, we uh, right mouse click and we go to interaction. Oh, no, sorry, device. I think it's kind of like the device. Oh, yeah. Uh, I think, oh. okay, so that's my interaction. Okay, so let's go to screen tap screen tab so it means that when i tap uh, there will be some interaction comes out okay so yeah so it's a ball right because a ball means yes or no right so when i tap it and it says yes and when i not tap it it's no so uh tap is a ball okay so let's do it okay so when I tap it, then what will it happen? I, because before I just tap it once and I couldn't get back. And I feel like it's so boring to just see like a, the genie comes out once and then just stay there. So I, I want to switch the toggle on and off. So when I tap once, it says yes. When I tap second times, it says no. So I have to have a, a function called switch. Uh, yeah, so switch. Okay, so it's under utility. And then let's see switch. So switch will be, okay, whatever function you have when you put it, uh, when you um, interact it once, it's on. Uh, the second time you will be off. It's on, off, on, off. So I need this one, okay. So this one, so basically I will make it like a, okay, when I tap it, it's on, okay, it's on, okay, okay, let, let me see the cheat sheet, <laughs> okay, so, yeah, so you see like a fully, so you can pretty much toggle it, okay, <laughs> okay, so, and then later, uh, we want this, to kind of like a, okay so oh so we need pulse pulse is to kind of like a similar to switch it's like a um we want it to come back and forth so we need pulse okay pulse is that trigger a pulse whatever a state change from on to off or vice versa okay so basically switch is that when i tap it's on right and then pulse is that, okay, so that's fully bit. Oh, sorry. Oh, so, so this is flip, okay. So that's, yeah, it's sometimes it's a little confusing. Okay, so when you tap it, you want it to, you know, like a switch it on and off. Okay, so this is the right thing to do. So if you want to do like a tapping stuff, and then you want it to first time tap, it's on. Second time tap, it's off. This is kind of the formula to do it. Yeah, so yeah. And then let's go here. Okay, so next one will be animation. Okay, so what, what's animation transition means? So uh, transition means convert a progress value to value between a new range defined by, a, by star and n. Okay, so basically what this means is that, okay, so when I toggle on, 
then something will animate from this value to that value. So yeah, so this is kind of like a, a, a really abstract concept, but I will show you later. So you probably can understand more. Okay, so, so what we want this to do is to make sure this genie, okay, so this is the original state we want, right? So uh, we want this to be invisible, right? So we don't want this to show up. So, so we go genie, yeah, and we go scale, right? It's scale, okay. So what this means is that if I turn on, this genie will start scaling from zero 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 to scale scale to one one one. Yeah, so this is the concept. So okay, so that's link. Okay, what will you do? Okay, so turn on turn off. Okay, so we want this to turn on. Oh, oh shit. Okay, so this is what we want, right? Okay, so, mm, okay, so let's try. Oh, there's a bug. Okay, so are not the same type. Okay. Maybe this? Okay. So let's. Sorry, I have to see the cheat sheet. Oh, okay, okay, I see. Okay, so basically you go here and then you turn on, you play the animation. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry. I didn't. Okay, so this needs to be under animation. So you couldn't just do this. This is a shortcut and it's making everything wrong. I'm sorry. Okay, so that's ad animation. So what animation means is that, okay. So yeah, previously we want this to be tap, right? Tap and it comes out to switch on and off. And then pulse will be like, okay, that's vice versa. When you tap once, then it's it's kind of turning on. And when you tap it, it's vice versa and turning off. So this is kind of the previous code. Okay, so we need an animation. Why? Because we want it to play, right? Start playing. And then when we start playing, and then let's see the cheat sheet. Okay, so go here. And if it is on, then that's play. If it is off, then that's reverse the animation. So it will scale back. Okay. So, okay. Okay, so basically, so you know that when you press it, it start playing the normal one. And when it's off, you see like this is turned on, right? So this is like a switch on and off. If and this is vice versa. When it's on, you go play. When it's off, you go reverse. Okay. Then let's do a transition. Transition means that convert a progress value from start to end. So if we want to make a different scale, means which means that yeah. So basically, we want to transition. Okay, so the first one is the scale. We want from nothing to big, right? We want like something like invisible to like, ooh, grow really big. And the second one, we want the position. The position, uh, we want like a, uh, the position start and move. So it start from this one and uh, move to another one. So we have two. So, the first one, uh, let's see, we need a scale. So we need to go here and then we have a scale, right? Okay, so this scale, I have the parameter, so I would love to copy it. Just to, um, let me see, okay, so. Okay, so star from zero and end from one, okay. So let's do it. So, okay, so this link to here, and then that's progress. Okay, so let's do progress. Progress, progress.
progress. Oh, this is progress. To see the chishi. Okay, yeah, right. So basically, this is because basically, I think, um, if you want the right uh, scripting, visual scripting, you have to link everything, in try and error, and you will find out. So this is the right one that I I tried. So basically, you go through the whole thing, and then you want this animation. If it is on, let's go to those two. One is scale. Another one will be uh, the rotation. And rotation will be this one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You see, because one 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 is not the right registration. So the reason why I put this dude. The, the 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 no object because I want to see. Okay, let's see. Come on. Okay, this this dude is. Ooh. Okay, so basically I want this to be you know here, and I want the position for this point, so I can make this dude grow from this point. Yeah, so that's the. That's the whole idea. Okay, so I, I figure it out. I try a lot, and then I find out this is kind of like the closer uh, uh, parameter. So I just copy it. <laughs> so you know how I do things. Yeah, it's just uh, the whole process of how I do things. So yeah, it took me probably an hour to just try the whole. Uh, the whole code. Okay, cool. Let's see. Yeah. So you have the star point, and you you have the end point. <laughs> okay. Cool. Oh. Oh. Seriously. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ah. Uh, I see. I see. I have to rotate this dude. Okay, so let's rotate. Oh, yeah. Sometimes I think there is a bug here, so I have to rotate this dude, and then if you place this dude to here, and it will become like like this. Yeah. So you need to rotate and place this next to this lamp, and you need to adjust the the value from start to end uh, according to your experiment. Okay, so this is a really big and cool scripting one o one using Aladdin comes in comes out by tapping first. And tapping second, pose, reverse, disappear. Okay, so yeah, and you also can uh, uh, kind of record it and make a video uh, from the phone, and you can go here and send to your phone and make uh, like a an actual augmented reality. So yeah, okay. So thanks for watching. And see you next time. Bye bye.